I think it's for farming. Like a pig killer? <laughs> no. Uh, I don't know. Catches hay bales or something. Anyways, we're in Stowe right now. Head into, what is it, Berlin? Yep. He's concentrating. There's some art, if you can call it that. Well, we're going to Berlin to comic shop. Supposedly has records. Too expensive. Cheap ass over here. I was more intrigued by the eight thousand dollar comics. Eight that what? There was he said there was over eight thousand comics. Oh, I thought you said comics that were selling for eight thousand dollars. <laughs> no, like, what could they be? A dollar a piece. How were those? See, I was trying while you were recording to not be complaining about the really nasty chunking sounds my truck was making when I slowed down. I was like, oh, come on. It's all right. I just got it now. Ooh. Started off with a yawn. It's always Ugh. good. And a burp. Ugh. So we just went through some construction, which yep. was very confusing. And now yeah, we're at the uh, Vermont Surplus, which apparently has a sale going on. Really? That's what the sign said. It's pretty sweet. I can dig a sale. Maybe <laughs> it's time for more shit. <laughs> Do you know what size desk you can get? No. Is it, is it supposed to go in the room with the bed? Because there's like jack shit room in there. I'm thinking of small desk. <laughs> I, I mean, I might set it up in the big room, so... No, I got a backup plan to do this. Alright, let's do it. Construction. Here goes the madness. I don't know what's gonna happen. See how many people are just standing around today. See how these people are gonna stop. Oh, they're not gonna leave all this. They better leave the hole. I think we're gonna get lucky. Now we gotta get onto the right side, baby. No. Should be able to do it. Just one motorcycle. Ah, what the fuck is that? What? Something flew in here. Is it still in here? Oh no. Brain attacked. Being attacked by a bee? I don't know. It could have just been like a leaf or something. Hopefully. But it was yellowish. Oh jeez. Could it feel heavy when it gets Is that impressive? Uh, kinda. Were you impressed by that loud ass motor? There's an asshole. Here comes another asshole. Me, 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 Look at that me. gaping, loose really? asshole. That old woman is a prolapse asshole. <laughs> That's your new favorite word. <laughs> prolapse. That's the word of the day! Prolapse! Like past us just to like, man, I'm gonna slow down on you. <laughs> She's undecided. Walking on the middle, baby. <laughs> Do I want to get back in the fast lane or I'll just stay in the middle? I think it's looking pretty lopsided, isn't it? Let's see. The Jeep. Uh, I guess it is leaning to the right a little bit. <laughs> Probably a fat person in the past. <laughs> so mean. And a helium person driving. Entering town of Middlesex. Haha, <laughs> Middlesex. Look at this asshole! Is the truck supposed to shake this much? Mine does. <laughs> it's almost like giving me a foot massage. That's why I was telling you about going, you know, more than 50 miles an hour. <laughs> oh, we have to do it. Woo! This is where you're really gonna start to feel it shake. Uh, they could probably hear it. <laughs> what? Yeah. Woo! They're gonna hit us! No way, man, we got this. I just gotta get to a bathroom. The funny thing is, you know. Why is he racing me? You know they're gonna pass us. I was just trying to get ahead of him, and then he can pass me on the other side. He's not giving you room to get in? Barely. <laughs> Fine, we'll see what this truck can fucking do. Six. Fucking asshole. We let him in, he's not letting us back in. Now you can get out of me, douche. 
I'm slowing down to fucking right lane speed. <laughs> 20 miles an hour. That'll show up. Dumbass. Yep, here comes the douchebag. Douchebag! It's a girl. I'm not surprised. Dumb bitch! <laughs> Exciting road adventures are taking a win. Yeah, the people that we hate from because that tape that to the you stopped on the bridge. What are they doing on the bridge? FedEx truck. Bridge. I know someone will try to pass me and then be like, oh no, I don't have a lane. <laughs> Hit me. You don't need to demonstrate. Yes, it Jerk in the wheel. Yeah. Scary. That's hardly a jerk. It was a slight shift. We were we were bouncing off the guardrail. <laughs> Knowing you, you'd do that, and then you'd freak out and overcompensate and steer back, and you'd shoot <laughs> it into the other lane. Like this constantly. <laughs> if you stop steering, it'll slow down. Don't run it. I'm scared of We're in the capital of Vermont. Yeah. The avenue. Montpellier. That's how you say it, right? Monkey <laughs> Oh! <laughs> I just realized I started pulling me into the thing. I was like, oh, am I, I'm still going 50. So I'd still slow down. I guess they're doing something. He's poking his head in the hole, looking for a corpse. Madness. What are those things called? That's like where the when the weather changes or something, it can expand. Yeah. Because I slowed down too much for the people behind me. They're just ripping it up. Must not <laughs> be expanding enough. Watch him take it out and then the bridge just falls down. Boop! All over holding the bridge up. <laughs> <laughs> it's like classic comedy where like everything else falls down but the bridge. Yeah. <laughs> classic Looney Tunes style. Oh no! I say that every time there's a bridge. Nobody's coming. We're in Berlin now. We made it. Okay. Where's the comics at? <laughs> They're in the middle of the road. How come, like, you notice the signs are square, but they round it with the paint? Yeah, oh. Why don't they round the sign? Because then you gotta, you have to use a special cutting thing instead of just have giant labels. <laughs> <laughs> so it makes them look more pleasant without costing too much more. I'm looking at those horrible edges. Oh, it's apparently coming right up. Well, we just left the comic shop. Jake's putting in the GPS. Better not look. Yeah. Uh, we bought some records. They were all six dollars, and he wouldn't budge on the price. Mm. Not at all. I bought twenty-dollar comics, and I bought. What are the other ones? I bought some new releases, some uh, some uh, dead some Deadpool and a Punisher one that I like the cover of. I saw some uh, I saw an Eerie magazine in the back. It was like in a glass case, and it was also inside of a plastic thing. There was like a bunch of it's probably where his old stuff is, but I saw an Eerie magazine. Scott, I looked at it. I'm like, there's an Eerie magazine. Scott would like that. I didn't see a price or anything on it. And the glass case inside of plastic skin. Mm -hmm. It's like double protected. Yeah, and like way in the back, so it's like you don't even <laughs> want you to look at it. Those are my comics. You mess with my comics. Good selection, he got a good collection. It's hot as hell in there though. Yeah, well, air conditioning costs more than that. Guess. There was just one other guy in there besides us, and uh, he was looking through sports cards. See, that's why you need to know what you're talking about. He likes to talk sports cards. I couldn't be like, so when are you going to put those new records out? <laughs> no. I don't give a fuck about those records. Yeah. Give them away, but not to you. Yeah, that was the best part, is Jake was looking through them, and the guy was like, we will try for $6, they don't sell it, put four, and then uh, you know, eventually down to a dollar. And then Jake was like, can you do $5 a piece? No. And that was the end of the conversation. Well, no, no. I had to leave behind one that had, it was pretty much the Rolling Stones, but not officially the Rolling Stones. <laughs> it was like something called Edward. I had to leave Alvin Lee, I had to leave a lot of George Duke. 
<laughs> so Argent I didn't have, there was a hot tuna I didn't have, there was just a lot of good stuff. But, you know, I guess we should come back in about two, three months and hopefully no one will have hit it. Yeah. <laughs> and he'll have lowered them to three bucks each and then it'll be more worth it to count. I only went through two of those boxes of the dollar companies. Really? Maybe three. There was a bunch stacked on top I thumbed through. And I guess we'll have to come back. Yeah. There was a lot lying out there. But the thing was weird. is like, that said dollar. And then on the other side, there was a bunch more that all said a dollar. But then on the side of the boxes, I've got a three dollar box. I'm like, are they just all a dollar? And there's just weird stickers on the side from last time. I don't know. I didn't bother asking. I probably went through three of them. They were probably like three, four feet long, I think. Yeah. Not in great shape. It's probably like a dollar. It should be 25 cents. I didn't see any cheap ones. All of them were, I saw were like a dollar. So, but then, like, this is a really disorganized. There's like, in the back, they have the new ones, which is like a pretty small section, I thought. I mean, they had the bigger ones. They had figures that I kind of looked at and just picked anything up. Yeah. But, uh, there was, uh, just boxes in the back, too, with like, you know, 1970. B through C, just like everywhere. I'm like, you just crack these open and start looking? I don't even know. But we come back. Let's come back on a cool day. There it is. It's like a baby monster truck with lightning bolts on. <laughs> sort of. Tony's hot dog. That was creepy. It's one that looks like it's sitting under the water. Yeah, old fire, fire truck. It's a staple of this road.